complete to Jonathan Lovely. Seven. Chase Edmonds carries five yards for the Fordham touchdown. Picked off by 43, Stephen Hodge. Football coach Joe Moorhead following their 38 31 victory over Georgetown. Coach, a uh, very hard fought victory. Georgetown kept coming back at you guys, and you persevered for a big win today, finishing 9 and 2. What are your thoughts? Uh, I, I just can't say enough about, about this football team, our seniors, and our leaders uh, for us to be able to persevere through adversity throughout the season, in particular today. And uh, you have a no excuses mentality, and for guys to be able to step up and make plays when they're needed uh, just says a ton about the character, the resiliency, the tenacity. Uh, the selflessness of this team and uh, the fact that we lost 18 stars and, and went through this schedule without a bye and finished 9-2 and two and ranked uh, you know, one of the top 25 teams in the country. Uh, it's a credit to our kids and our coaches. You get big performance today from your two senior linebackers, Steve Hodge with a pick six today, Barletta seven tackles and the pick to seal it there at the end. Talk about their performance today. No, nah, the, uh, the defense did a fantastic job today. And, uh, you know, Stephen, I, I asked him before the game, I said, hey, put this one on your back and take us to a victory. And, you know, he uh, he's a guy that personifies what it's all about in, in terms of his preparation, his effort, you know, his, uh, you know, his execution in the game and what he means to us. And, uh, you know, David had a fantastic you know, day, you know, filling in for Nico and splitting time with him. And, uh, you know, it's just that next man in mentality. When someone someone goes down, our kids don't flinch. And they go in and they're expected to perform at a very high level. You talk about that next man mentality. Uh, Brevard comes in 
40 yards rushing at the end. They had Sealer touchdown, the game-winning touchdown at the end. Talk about how he came in and stepped in for Edmonds. <laughs> you know, uh, you never know when your number's going to be called. And, you know, you know, Jared, it's the third team tailback the entire season, gets him in more reps during the, the, during the week because uh, you need to get them to one and two. And, and we always stress to our guys that you're, that you're one or two plays away at most. And with keep KP down for the season and Chase going down, you know, Jared stepped in there like he's been doing it the whole time. And he's a very incredibly talented player. And, you know, stepped up in a crucial situation and, you know, ran a kid over at the goal line and scored the, scored the game-clinching touchdown. So, uh, you know, credit goes to him and Coach Fogarty. And, you know, I think a, a lot of it, you know, goes back to the culture of our program where, where we have great kids and, you know, they do all the little things right. Well, congratulations on another big win, Coach. Enjoy it with your team. Yes, sir. Thank you. We're here with sophomore running back Jared Brevard of the Fordham football team following their 38-31 victory over Georgetown. Jared, a big performance by you today in relief at Chase. Coach talks about that next men mentality. How were you prepared to step in and you get the game winning touchdown, your first career touchdown today? I um, just stepped in. I was a two this week after KP went down. I'm just trying to know my role and do my job. And Chase went down, unfortunately, and I had to go in there and try to be his best as Chase. This team fought hard. Georgetown kept coming back and back on you guys. You fight through it. Talk about the heart of this team and, and the mental makeup of this team to, to put this game away late. Oh, it's definitely definitely the culture. You know, we got, we got great coaches. They put us in the right they put us in the right position, and we went out there and performed. For for yourself, that first career touchdown. Uh, it, I was right on the corner of the end zone where you kind of broke through there. How did you see that play developed uh, to get to the pile on there? Uh, O-line, great blocking, got the ball, bounced it outside, one dude to beat, put my head down, and scored a touchdown. Well, congratulations on a great win today, Jared, and congrats on that first career touchdown. Thank you. Appreciate it, sir. Appreciate it. We're here with senior David Barletta of the Fordham football team following their 38-31 victory over Georgetown. David, you get that game-clinching interception on that last drive. Talk about that last drive and how the defense held up. Well, we came uh, we came strong. We knew we had to stop them. If we stopped them, the game would have been over. Uh, our coach did a great job game planning, told me exactly where to go, and uh, I was lucky enough he threw it to me. Last regular season game of your Fordham career, yourself and Steven Hodge, both with interceptions today. Talk about that linebacker performance today. Georgetown kept coming at you, play after play after play, score after score. How were you guys able to finally clinch that win? Well, they kept coming down. Uh, unfortunately, uh, Nico got a little uh, cramped up, so I had to come in. And uh, Steve always, he's, he's a big leader. He tells us what to do. Uh, when we went on the sideline, our coaches made great adjustments, and we were able to come back. Every play we know what they're going to run, and we run downhill and just stop the gaps. Coach talks about that next man up philosophy. How big was that philosophy today? <laughs> well, it definitely was big. Uh, we know uh, that if someone goes down, we got to do as good of a job or better. And uh, I'm lucky enough to have a guy in front of me that uh, he works me hard and, and teaches me what to do, even though he's a sophomore. But uh, we're working hard. All our guys are ready to go. Well, congratulations on a big win. Enjoy the win with your team. Thank you. Thank you.